The rise, fall, and return of the former prime minister's son, Moses Shaimbaro, is a tale every Belizean knows all too well. From a rapper turned convict, turned politician, turned leader of the, the opposition, it's to hard to deny how significant the younger Barrow's evolution has been. In fact, it's a story so remarkable that it caught the attention of Disney and its partners, Anscape. In January, Shine announced his Disney deal for a documentary, a movie, and a television series to be produced based on his life. The Disney team is in Belize now and have already started filming the documentary for Hulu. We caught up with them last night at the Cork Street Whiskey Bar at a welcome reception. Well, this is just a, 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 a celebratory meeting, a welcome meeting. Uh, you know, Disney Anscape is happy to be here happy to be commencing production and this is just how they, they treat their partners you know and so I invited close family and friends um, because it, it's something to celebrate uh, you know how many Belizeans uh, I don't know of any other Belizean who has had this opportunity to have their life uh, documented by um, uh, such a giant in the motion the film and motion picture um, industry uh, so it really is a celebratory moment. Uh, Disney has always been excited about the deal. That's why they did the deal in the first place. And so this is how they've treated me every step of the way. Very great partners. Marcus Clark, who directed the Blood Brothers, Malcolm X and Muhammad Ali documentary for Netflix, says he has a tactile feel for Shine's story. Yeah, well, you know, I'm born and raised in Brooklyn, New York. Um, I grew up around the time Shine's music was coming out. So I have an intimate memory and recollection of when he was coming out, when he was getting signed to Bad Boy, his history and his story. So for Brooklyn, I know it's something that's incredibly important. And his life story in general as a documentarian, um, it's the kind of stories we look for that are super interesting. You know, someone who's gone through evolution and has had trials and tribulations throughout their life. And really the story is how do you deal with the difficult things that happen in your life? How do you overcome and how do you triumph? I remember, you know, the situation that he went through. And so flash forward now, you know, 20 some odd years later to see what he's doing in politics, and how he's completely changed his life around, the direction of his life, his career. It's an impressive story. It's an important story. For Barrow, it's important that Belize also gets some shine. I'm so delighted that we are here in Belize uh, doing production, hiring Belizeans. Uh, they have a young man that is going to um, play me. They're going to do some reenactments of my childhood uh, and we have uh, other Belizeans working on the production staff um, so it is a great moment uh, that was predicted by your uh, executive director of Channel 7 um, when he I, I think I was on on cut and he said you know your life story is worth millions of dollars and you know you'll monetize it one day with some big uh, television production company and so we're happy that Disney slash Anscape which is uh, their urban uh, entity uh, that we were able to do that deal and that we're able to commence production and next year you'll see the uh, Shine bio documentary in theaters and on streaming platforms all over the world. Jo Marie Lanza, 7 News.